wings report in. Red leader standing by. Hello viewers, it's Enter Gaming here and today we are back on Assassin's Creed Valhalla. Small disclaimer, if you hear something in the background, it is raining. I have tried to make it so that it doesn't get picked up as much, but there's only so much I can do. Anyway, today we are going to be doing an alliance quest. Uh, I think my friend said that there are two? There you are. Like one where we can go with Sigurd, but then one where we can go to the other place. I don't know what the other place is, but eh, guess we'll find out. You wanted to see me. As Sigurd has so ordered, it falls to us to expand our presence in England. He wants to forge alliances, ironclad, with every Norse, Dane, and Saxon here. Right. We are the outsiders here. Making friends will help. Where do we start? My scouts come and go daily with interesting news and tidings. And I'm beginning to get my bearings in this fractured land. As I learn more, I can give you insight into each territory before you commit to a journey there. Of course. Once you have gained an ally in a territory, return home and speak to me. We'll decide your next move then. I understand. So, where do we start? You have two options just now. Join Sigurd in Leatherchestershire to the north and meet with the sons of Ragnar Lothbrok. Or head south to Grantebridgeshire to meet an army of Danes led by one Guthrum Jarl and his second, Soma. I should add, our young friend Hytham has been conferring with his own contacts in the cities. His research could be useful in winning us alliances throughout the cities of England. Speak with him and see what he needs. I want to see the alliance map. Okay, seems pretty straightforward. If you want your settlement to thrive in England, your clan must forge alliances. Pledge to a territory to confirm your interest in an alliance. As pledges are completed and, and allies are made, other territories will be made available. Uh, well, she said Sigurd went here, so I think he has it covered there for a while. So, I think we should go here. Tell me about Grandebridgeshire. A force of Danes, called the Summer Army by the Saxons, is camped north of Grandebridge at some ruins across the river. We should curry favor with their leaders, Guthrum and Soma, if we hope to win their trust and allegiance. My scouts did not meet them in person, so I can say little for the state of their army. Consider this a starting point. Yeah, they were definitely going to start with Grand Char. I mean, they're both the same level, but like I said, Sigurd got the other thing. I will leave right away. Good. And may the blessings of Freya follow. You know, the problem with stabbing a map like that is back then someone had to hand draw all that. Uh, they had to hand paint and everything. And not to mention, had to get a thing big enough. And if they messed up, well, then they had to start all over, basically. And then here's these leaders that just stabbed the map. Like, it reminds me of that picture of the, of like the people stabbing the map. And there's just like a guy freaking out in the background. <laughs> uh, it's like... Uh, it just seems like a waste to stab a map like that because I don't know a lot of work just for someone to stick a hole through it. Hey. Let's go. Hail! What has happened here? Who is asking? Avon of the Raven Clan. Did you and your men fail to take the village? No. No, we had it for a time. It was nothing but a cluster of waterland daub huts when we came. We made it lively. Grantbridge was a thriving hub of trade and song under the care of Soma Ayalskona. But the Saxons took it back. They appeared within the city as if rising from the shadows and drove us out.
They just appeared in the city. It was like they burst out of the center of the city itself, setting aflame everything in their path, shouting some nonsense about an ancient order of warriors. By the time I saw the fires, too many of us were killed or captured. Our Yasko Masuma, she bellowed the retreat and we took refuge in the ruins. But in the chaos, we were separated. She and the bulk of our forces fled northeast into the swamps. I'd follow if we were fit to. We need her iron fist. I can find Soma. Be ready when we return. She'll be deep in the fog of the Fenlands by now. Find her longship. That's your best bet. I can see a long ship there. Oh, there's people here. Wait, wait, wait. Aren't these the... Aren't these the people we're looking for, or...? Oh, these are not the people we're looking for. They don't. Hello. Uh, I can't wait to find the legendary weapon. Oh, you are a snitch. Okay. The two types of enemies that I don't like so far. Spear guys and dagger guys. Because with the dagger guys, you will literally be trying to hit them and they'll just do a slight lunge forward and poke you. It's a little hard to see who's who here. But we'll send them all to hell either way. By the way, if you want to be able to take down bigger enemies a lot faster, like ones that are out of your level range, get the stomp. Because if you're fighting people that are out of your level range, like if, like, see that little white dot next to its health bar? If it's red, if you get the stomp, trust me, it will take down the enemy's health a lot. I mean, I've even fought people that were in skull level. Like, I even fought people that were, like, in skull level, and the stomp definitely helped. Now, it's still gonna be difficult because they're out, they're not the right level, but. It's a lot easier. You have my true thanks, friend. There you go, buddies. My thanks, the gods favor you. Oh, we got twins right here. And yeah, we got treasure. Hey, bud. Uh, looking for your boss. Your yards corner nearby. Not here. Shoma dragged the Saxons east from her longship to tire them out and lose them in the fog. Hmm. There. Beached longship. Dane markings. If this was a fine longship, fit for a chief. It must be Here's kind of keeps family clutch firmly in fists. Loves deeply her city of summer and mist. I do like that the arrows do stay in them, although I'm pretty sure that these are have already been dead. So if I'm going to guess correctly, I think I just followed the dead bodies. Oh, we got some more over here.
Gonna go ahead and guess they set up somewhere over here. Yep. Now, a lot of people would say, like, like, really? That's not all that big a distance. What, like... It's like I explained in one of my other series. Like, maps are condensed. So, for us, that was like, what, probably a few inches or a few feet? But for him in the game, that was like... Probably like a mile's worth of walking. You're still in fighting shape. Take him to the shelter for warmth. Slap some moss in that gash and wrap it well. Egil. Egil, look at me. Remember the boars you felled our first day in England. Hold his arms. Nine. Large and fat. Fed us for a week. Yeah. 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 Ah! 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 You'll be chasing more in a month, my friend. You come like a Valkyrie out of the fog. But we have no dead to give you. You must be Soma. Let's talk elsewhere. Give them a chance to rest. Quite a hit you took. How many were lost? It's kind of you to ask, but with so much blood in the water and death on the air, I'd know your name and purpose first. Eivor of the Raven Clan. I came for you, looking for a friend and ally. I see. I'm Soma, Lord of Granbridge. Though it seems an Order of Lunatics wishes to strip me of that title. The Order of the Ancients? Sounds right. The Saxon called Wigmund is one of them. He robbed me of my city, forced us into these swamps. I've rallied some of my soldiers, but my three advisors are missing. If we hope to retake Grantbridge, I'll need them at my side. Tell me about them. They are my best, my inner circle. Bilna, Galin, Leif. We may as well be of the same blood. If I can reunite them and we retake your city, can I call you a friend and ally? If you can do all that, you can call me whatever you want. What happened to Granbridge? The elder man Wigman seized it from us. I'm not sure how he managed, but he will not keep it. Not for long. He has supporters outside the city. But this attack seemed to come from inside the walls. From the heart of Granbridge. Where's this Wickmund? What does he want? He's a flailing elderman under the old king. A bitter man digging his fingernails into Grantbridge, just to say he can. He's made many attempts to unseat me before. This time he managed a trick. Let's find your advisors. Agreed. We'll look for signs of their longboats along the river. And if we are swift, we will find them before the wolves do. The fog is more hindrance than hiding place now. Let's light the way back. <sighs> Does make sense. I mean, a fog like this, it's gonna be hard to see where to go. But if you have a light, then you have some idea. Bright wolf of the branch, and guide Soma's gilded warriors home. Okay, random key. Okay. Uh, we got one at 361. Yeah, let's go for the 361 first. I know what you must think. What must I think? 
that it's foolish to search the Fenlands for so few people. You told me the soldiers you lost were your best. Vital to retake in the city. Do you think it's foolish? Hold on, let me see if there's any... Yeah, let's definitely go for the... Let's definitely go for that one first. I want to see if they were like... You have the look of one who does well with solitude. You're alone, a wanderer. It may be you think of soldiers as war fodder and little else. But these warriors are more than a blade and shield. They are my family, nothing short. I've lost a city this week. I will not lose them too. I understand. And if your people yet live, we'll find them. Yeah, I just wanted to check and see if like they were on the same island as me. A group of Danes held captive. I think we found one of them. Yes, I'm that doesn't belong to you. And we're here to take him back. Here. You should hold on to that better. Stop it! Ooh, I think that one in his eye. <laughs> mm, that's that can't feel well. Like that cannot feel good at all. Hello, Leaf. If you would be so kind, I've had quite the day. Look through the fog, Leaf. Follow the beacon. Our camp is at its base. We'll return when we found the others. We'll head straight to the camp and see that everyone's ship shape when you return. Uh, let's go this way. Leaf is a prim and proper man, isn't he? He lives by a strict code of honor, more than... He lives by a strict code of honor, more than most. And builds the best longships I've ever sailed. This longboat is big, I think. All scraped and bashed, it's hard to tell. Saxons, surrounding that old hut. There may be Danes trapped inside. That's right! Tire yourself out! <laughs> Even open one barricade. Oh, not in hell when we're done with you. You'll suck my toes when I'm standing on your head. That's fair enough, for sure. If my head was in a bucket of water, I'd stay now. In the leg. In the chest. Spearmint's gum. Refreshing. Okay, in the time it took you to kill one, I killed, like, what? Five? Four? Fuck! Soma! I knew I heard someone sweeping the hearth outside. We handle it just fine. Thinking of starting a new town, in fact. This house being our first. Birna, I pitched a camp nearby, under a burning beacon. We'll meet you there when I've found the others. Thank you, Soma. And you as well, Sambin. We'll head to the camp now. I'll have everyone singing songs and dancing jigs. Birna is like a grapevine, curly and hard to predict. While Leaf is like a wood beam, sturdy, straightforward. Birna has a genius for tactics, sees well ahead of things. Leaf deals with what's just there before him, practical in all ways. Both have helped me find my footing in desperate times. It's important to keep those who disagree with you close as family. Okay, never mind. I do like that you can see the beacon sometimes. Like when the fog is just right, you can see it 
over the horizon. Okay. We're looking for... Gallon? I think his name was. Yeah, also I did change the uh, skin of the raven I have. Yeah, I did change my raven because whenever I was doing like some gameplay with it and all, I found that with the glowing eyes, it... It would sometimes obscure the screen. But, oh well. I don't mind the one I have. I like the paint on it. Hey, bud. You doing fine? Don't Got fall him. off. You look terrible. What happened here? Saxons chased me into the fog, ran me smack into a nest of bandits. But Freya was on my side, and I saw them before they saw me. Are you the only one of your crew left standing? I am. And hardly standing myself. But with the blessings of Odin and Freya, they'll be feasting well with the gods. <laughs> It's like it's one thing to kill the wolves, it's another thing whenever I have to do like the takedown on it because it... Uh, it just... I don't like the sound of the whimpering. Okay. Come on, Galen. Let's get all y'all back to camp. drawn the last of my soldiers by tomorrow our strength will have returned and we can retake our city i have not yet spoken to leave Birna and galen about this after my missteps i worry what they must think of me they'll be grateful you risk your life to find them i would be By Thor's hammer, I am glad we're together. In spite of our setback. Galen, you look... well warm. Do not grieve the men you lost. They will be singing your praises in the corpse hall, waiting for us. Thank you, Jarl's Corner. Leif, you'd outlast any tempest. It's good to be back, Sorma. All as one. And know this, that I will follow you through the eye of the storm if you called. Birna. I'm delighted you're alive. I'm delighted to be living. I lost so many after all this, but I still have you three. That makes me the most blessed warrior in Midgard. And Eivor, you have more than proven your worth. Help us reclaim our city, and you will have an ally in me. My blade is yours, for Grandbridge. We'll rest for the night. Gather our strength and our wits, and at the break of dawn's light, we retake Grand Bridge! Pass the night in our camp, Eivor. Take anything you need. Like more of so the beacon back to camp. Leaf, Soma says you're the man who built her longships. That's right. Each has a sharp keel, a stout mast, and a poem etched into the hull to sing the praises of the Dringer who commands her. 
A long ship is heavy with fate. Just a few lengths of wood between you and a watery grave. What better place to put a line of poetry, hmm? Agreed. It's good to fight beside you leave. Likewise, Ava. Thanks again for plucking me and my warriors from the mire. Garlan, is that right? That's right. And you are Eivor, the infinite fighter, a forever warrior. It's a glorious name. Many thanks. You were in a tight spot when we found you. Indeed. The Saxons pursued me, ran me bloody through the swamps and into the lap of bandits. Then the wolves came. We all have our one day, the day we die. How you greet that day is all that matters. I'm proud to say that I was ready. Well, it's good to see you breathing still. The day is new, and the air is bracing. Are you ready for the fight ahead? Let's take your city back. That's what I like to hear. Meet me at the western gate of Grantbridge. We've assembled there. Have care you do not enjoy taking orders from anyone but your Jarl back home. I fight for Sigurd. None else. While you're on this ship, Dag, you fight for me, and for Soma's loyalty. We fight for her. Mike, okay, what is Dag's problem? Like, Sigurd ordered him to follow my command while, I, while he's away. I have never claimed, and that guy's going for a swim, I have never claimed that I am better than Sigurd. I never claimed that I was taking Sigurd's spot. I'm just the obvious choice when it comes to being a second in command to him. I mean, who else is he going to trust? You? No, 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 no. You are too brash. You don't... Dag never thinks before going into a fight. Let's have a song. Plus, all he wants to do is start trouble. He wants to start trouble when there's none. He keeps that up. Can't wait to see what Sigurd thinks of it. What the heck? Turn Grand Bridge to me, Wigmund. No more of our people need die. We may talk this out, lord to lord. Ha <laughs> ha! What are we to talk about? You have nothing I need. Worth by birth, even. I was born a noble. You were plucked from a giant's armpit. I built this town. From a mud hut to a thriving port. And we both know you'll bleed those ridges dry without my guiding hand. Leave! Go die in the muck where you belong, heathens! Wigmund, 
Wigman, let's try one final time. Quit Grand Bridge. And when she is mine once more, I may spare your life. Ha! I command Grand Bridge. I am master here. And I will scour you rats from this land like rot from a festering wound. Let me give you some advice, old bear. The surest way to stop a wound from festering isn't with a blade. It's with fire. Now, let's start healing. Time you no! Veins of Grendebrickshire! We take what is yours! God. And he says he's what's best for this place? From what it's looking like... From what it's looking like, it looks like he's only done what's worse for it. Uh, I thought I could call my people in. Like, really, look at... He has people just strung up. And he's saying that he's what's best for this place. Also, gotta say, that is one sturdy cape. I got you. There you go. I haven't seen Wigman since we breached the wall. Regroup at the longhouse. We'll surely find him there. My thanks. No problem, buddy. Okay, Wigman, where the heck are you? Agreed, buddy. Also, he's ho that person is holding a broad, a two-handed broadsword and an axe. I wonder if that, I wonder if that's something that we can end up doing. Don't worry. Okay, I think that's everyone here. Come on, guys, we gotta push it to the longhouse. Okay, who's first? You're first. Who's second? Spread out. We have this. Do you? Do you really? Because I don't think you do. Okay, you're third. Watch out. I got mace. <laughs> Although this is technically ain't a mace, it's a warhammer, but... Hammer down. I don't understand. I thought we were going to the longhouse. Really? I hate when it does that. Like when it makes you turn around just to... Because you miss a checkpoint or whatever. You know, Soma, you could, uh, 
you could, uh, you know, go faster. Just saying. Just saying. Yeah, yeah, you're building up the dramatics. You walk faster. Wigmund! You cannot hide from me forever. Come face your death. Heathen eels. Wigmund's gone. He's gone. <laughs> oh, it's a Dark Souls boss. <laughs> And stomp! See what I mean? Got him! Got him, got him! Got him! Let your plague ridden body feed my fields. Eivor, to me. I am strange. I gotta say, these guys are a lot lighter once they're dead. No sign of Wickman here. He may be hiding within the city walls. Shall we search? No. He'll be gone. Count on it. Argar coward. But we've struck a bold claim today. Walk with me. I want you to sound our battle horn to announce our victory. Let all the Shire know that Grandbridge is retaken. The sound of the horn means prosperity, long life, bounty. Why me? Why not? You were the keystone to this attack. You turned the tide. Let the wind from your lungs breathe life back into my city. I've always wanted to do this. My clan throws the best feasts, I think you'll find. You enjoy yourself? I did. But were you celebrating a morning? You looked unsure. The night of the attack, I heard sounds of bloodshed coming from the Longhouse. In moments, the city was overrun with Saxons, so I called a retreat. We all have our one day, but not like that. Not that day. I've heard this before. That the Saxons appeared as if from the shadows. In all my time in Grantbridge, this tunnel was my most careful project. The best kept secret in the city. Now a hundred or more Saxons know the smell of it. The only people who knew about this tunnel were me. And the three in my inner circle. You believe you were betrayed? I know I was. By whom? 
That is where I hesitate. Between Leaf, Galen, and Birna, I cannot say. But they are the three who helped me dig this in secret. I hoped you might lend me your wits. You are a fresh ally. I could use your eyes and ears. I promised you I'd help secure your city. That task isn't yet done, it seems. Good. I sent Galen, Leif, and Birna to destroy what remains of Wigman's power throughout the Shire. Meet with them. Raid with them. Get to know them as best as you can. Find out which of them betrayed me. A betrayal so wicked, I cannot imagine. Yet someone willing to break an oath like that must bear some sign or defect. I need clear, sound judgment. I need you, Eivor. You have me. Thank you. Feel free to take a look around as you wish. Search the city, the tunnel, and here, a gift, for retaking Grand Bridge with us. One of the few things I have left from my blood family. Well, we've taken back Grand Bridge, but I think that is going to be it for this episode. And we shall pick up in the next one where we'll figure out who did the deed. Also, I got to decide what I'm going to put this in. But yeah, so in the next one, we're going to have to solve some kind of mystery or something. From what I can gather, depending on the... Seeing how the bed is like that. I'm guessing the bed goes on top of the hole or something. It has to be covered some way. I mean, she says that it's her best kept secret, but I mean... Anyone can see it from over there. Look, now even she knows. In fact, now she knows too much. No, you know too much! Stop resisting! Fine, I'll... I'll let her off with a warning. Anyway, that is gonna be it for this episode. And like I said, next episode we'll go and find out who did the deed of the betrayal. Looks like it's gonna be an Among Us gameplay. <laughs> uh, I would love to do Among Us gameplay one day. But, that is gonna be it for this episode. So, with all that being said... Thank you all so much for watching. If you'd like to subscribe, leave a like, and as always, please leave a comment down below. Because comments are the only way I can improve on these. If you and if you want to chat with me directly or check out updates on the channel, check me on my Twitter at Antilles Gaming. And without that being said, I will see all of you in the next episode. <laughs>